of advice that I heard from another casting director was to set a time limit. You know, if you're working on your self tape for three hours, you're not going to get three hours on set to do that. You know what I mean? Um, you know, when, when we were, you know, before COVID times back in the day, uh, you would have, you know, a 10 minute appointment, a 15 minute appointment, uh, and that would, you would come in and you would have that specific time. I'm not saying to necessarily give yourself 10 minutes to do the tape, um, but I would say, you know, you know, you're like, okay, I'm going to, I'm going to do the self tape from start to finish in 30 minutes and then give yourself that time. Because again, when you get to that real set or you get to that real, you know, stage or something, you're not going to have all that time and you're not going to get into your head so much because you just don't have that time. Um, so I, I would say my piece of advice would to set that timer uh, so that you don't, you know, think of those small things. But on the flip side, you know, it is a self tape. So you do have time, more time than you would, you know, going into a room. But I don't want somebody spending three hours on a self tape. something to think about as for like an adjustment is something that I would say even if we weren't in COVID times we have to fall in love with you in the first 15 seconds and I think that's even more important for self tapes more than ever um, but I know a lot of actors are like oh I must save this thing for the end and it's like why you know like like why give all the goods at the top honey um, so yeah I would just say I'd we need to fall in love with you in the first 15 seconds. And I think that's like a human instinct thing. I think that's not, that's that goes beyond the artist tree of it all. But like, you know, you could be at a dinner party, you know, pre-COVID or, you know, something out with friends and a stranger and something that you're just like, oh, I love that person. You're like, why do you love that person? It's like, oh, I don't know. Or, you know, me and that person's not going to vibe. And it's like, why not? And it's like, I don't know. Something about it in the first 15 seconds. And sometimes it's easy. Yeah, some, sometimes it's verbal and sometimes it's nonverbal. Um, but, but finding ways to to hook us in in the first 15 seconds uh, I think I think is key maybe you know my piece of advice would be to send it to someone like if you do you know a couple of takes and send it to someone who's maybe not even in the business you know, maybe someone who you're close to that's not an actor or not a director or casting director to see what they get from it, because that's at the end of the day who is going to be watching this. Most of the time, you know, the people aren't in the industry. But, you know, I think a lot of it just comes from insecurities and trying to be perfect. But realizing that we know that nobody's perfect, regardless if, if you are a religious person or more on the science side or, or both. Uh, everything shows us that we're not perfect and so no one's asking for, for per perfection so if you're trying to lead into oh it has to be perfect it has to be perfect it's not gonna happen you know what i mean but as long as you do the work and everything and your objectives are clear your choices are clear um i would say sending it to someone else just to you know have eyes on it and so you can be at ease uh would be would be my advice <music> When it comes to volume with self tapes play the scene not your setting so if you are in a coffee shop most of the time you're going to be right next to your scene partner or knee to knee right you you might be an arm's length so that should dictate how you would use your volume you know i think that when people are saying uh you're being too big they're using that term wrong 90 percent of the time it has to do with your volume you know because when you're on stage of course you're projecting and we, when you know back in the day when again we were coming in you know for auditions people would come in and they would just you know be done with their matinee and they would still have the projection voice and we're like oh let's do it again just held back on the bottom there was like oh okay eight shows a week i'm so sorry boom 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 um so most of the time just dial down on that volume and that energy that you're bringing into that volume is going to go somewhere else right um and especially you know if it's a scene like an intimate scene or a scene where you're you know telling something that you've never said before you know i i don't like the whisper you know don't whisper but talk normally you know and if you're mic'd it's going to catch you you know um so so just realize that you know playing the scene not necessarily like even if we're in person and your reader is you know three like 30 feet away from you don't play to that reader play to the scene um, because that volume is going to be too too loud for that and, you know of course if you're yelling or, or doing something like that that's one thing but most scenes you're just talking you're sitting and talking to someone um, so using your just regular voice is is fine 
And I think also that goes back into, I can't stress it enough, always watch yourself take back, right? Always watch yourself tape back. If you have time, send it to someone else because your self tape would be beautiful on your computer or your phone. And then for some reason on something else, it's not synced, you know, it's pixelated. So if you do have time, send it to someone else to see how long it's downloaded. You know, sometimes self tapes take 20 minutes to download and that's 20 minutes a little too long, you know? And that's why I was talking about the, the, the file size, uh, you know, the 720 or, or the 980 situation um, because it doesn't have to be too big, but just send it to a friend, you know, see how long it downloads and see if it, it plays and it's synced up, you know, so, so that it's, it's not corrupt. 